We're going to begin tonight with an update on a brutal murder that claimed the life of a young Corpus Christi woman and her unborn child. Today, the man charged with two counts of capital murder pled guilty to both charges and then chose to leave his fate in the hands of a jury. Our Rudy Trevino is in the courtroom for us, and it is our top story tonight. Rudy. Well, Joe, 32-year-old Arturo Art Garza, a convicted felon, faces from life to death. Those are the two options. The jury has to decide which one warrants that heinous crime. Patricia Gonzalez, mother of 28-year-old Susana Eguia, told jurors the family first found out that their daughter may have been murdered via social media. This after reading that a body of a woman had been located in an abandoned building on Cheyenne Street. A man who was living across the street testified he heard screams coming from the building hours before the body was discovered. What do you do at that point in time? At the gate, I screamed out there. What did you scream? For him to leave her alone. Did, how did you say it? I screamed, leave her alone. You, you know? said, leave her alone? Yeah. Uh, did anyone answer back to you? How is life without Susan? Unbearable. Very bold back to be honest, I have to be here. The only reason that I'm here is because I've got the voice. But I would rather not be in this world. The murder claimed uh, not only the life of Susana Aguilla, but also that of her unborn child, the girl. She was sem seven months pregnant. She leaves behind two young boys. And as I mentioned, the jury has two options to choose from in its range of punishment, life in prison without parole or death. Joe? Rudy, thank you.